And after I wrote it, I thought, I just felt I hadn't truly explored that transformational moment in her life when her husband shoots himself and then she takes over the Washington Post newspaper. And knowing that there had been abuse in her life with him, I thought, well, I I just didn't delve into it deeply enough. I didn't know very much myself about what suffering from abuse would be like. So I set out to do it in a different form, a form I'd never done before, which is a play. And that was how I came to the shot. And it allowed me to, first of all, learn more about the issue, learn more about her in the context of being a woman who uh, suffered from abuse. And then luckily, I found two wonderful partners who also understood and want to explore that with me. And without giving too much away, 